Hello Leo, welcome to Truth Will Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your messages from Spirit Reading for January 2021 for the sign of Leo. So let's get straight into your reading Leo and pull your first Spirit Message card. So what is the message Leo needs to hear please? Remember the Spirit Messages can be something specific, it can just be advice Leo. So let's see what we get with you. What is the message? Angels, spirits, guides for Leo. Thank you. What does Leo need to hear? Okay, very nice. It's light energy as well, new beginnings. So everything in life is constantly vibrating and moving and therefore continuously changing and evolving. Be aware that a new beginning is on the horizon. Have courage and faith because right now life is trying to nudge you forward and move you in a new direction. Feels very hopeful. Okay, I'm going to pull another card. <clears throat> what do we have for January 2021, please, Angel Spirits Guides for Leo? What is the message Leo needs to hear the most? Oh, I love it. I mean, I can see the fire energy in this card. We have number 22. I mean, 22 um, is a really nice energy. I mean, do look up at the multiple twos. Uh, because it is an energy of you're being assisted by angel spirits guides. Um, Kundalini rising, ignite your passion for life. And it feels towards whatever this new beginning is promising you here. Okay. So I'm going to pull three cards. The first card is the issue or challenge you need help or advice from spirit on. Second card is the advice from spirit. Third card is the outcome, should you take the advice. And then we clarify the cards and go deeper into the message, Leo. And it won't resonate with everybody, so just take what resonates with you, as always. So what do we have, please, angel spirits guides for Leo? January, that flew out. <laughs> We've got the Four of Swords. Advice from Spirit Leo, we have the Page of Wands. Love that energy, fire energy. And your outcome. Oh my goodness, that's brilliant with the Knight of Swords. Okay, let's see how we clarify this. What do we have, please, for Leo? Angel, Spirit's Guides, what is the message for Leo? Can we clarify the cards on the table, please, for Leo, Angel Spirits Guides? Thank you. Okay. Very nice. So I've got Justice and the Sun. The Page of Wands is clarified with the Emperor. And the Knight of Swords, Leo, is... Oh my goodness, you've got the Knight of Swords again. Uh, oh, I love it. Six of Pentacles. This is very nice energy. There's an energy of igniting your passion for life. And I see that that's the advice from spirit. It's time to ignite your passion. Um, because for some of you... This is an energy of being in a process of recovery or trying to get perspective on how, perspective on how you need to move forward. The, the Four of Swords can be about, is mental energy, it's our mind, it's our thinking behaviour, our perceptions, our thought patterns. Um, and, you know, this knight has been in battle, he's taken a breather. So there is, an, in essence, there's essentially a, a feeling of, of just regrouping re-strategizing and formulating a plan on how to go back out to battle. It might well be that you've been dealing with something, this is that period of recovery, or understanding how you move forward now in a situation and that is your challenge. Because, I mean, the beautiful energy is, with the sun, I mean, it feels an energy of balance is restored, or balance is going to be restored in your life. 
Now, justice is a great balancing energy. Uh, justice restores balance, whether it's to do with legal situations that you've been through um, and you needed an arbiter or a judge, in whatever situation to restore balance. And it's always in the light of truth and fairness. You know, it's that kind of energy. It can sometimes be about waiting on decisions and choices. Uh, sorry, waiting on decisions from somebody if it's to do with legal situations. Um, can be to do with things like contracts as well. But, you know, it, it is the justice energy is an energy of, of fairness, of, of truth, of the universe karmically restoring balance in a situation. So it feels a very beautiful energy here because there is definitely an energy of something is releasing here. There has been some kind of challenge where you needed to get balance back. Now that could be legal situations, it could be other situations in your life. Um, and there's definitely a feeling of balance being restored, having gone through some kind of period of recovery. Or well, that's what you needed. You wanted, I mean, it can be to do with something to do with fairness as well. If you've been treated unjustly in a situation and you've been recovering from it, there's definitely an energy of you will release and move on from it. Certainly with the Sun card, which is your ruler, um, this is about putting a difficult situation behind you, an obstacle, a block, and coming through the other side. So whatever the situation is, Leo, I mean, the, the, the sun is, is a card of celebration, happiness, joy, um, good news, abundance, finding the path. But it's, it's, it is a card of release, recovery, restoration. So it feels like you've been healing or recovering from a situation where some kind of justice was needed. But it feels certainly in this situation, you will come through the other side of it, even though that is still a challenge. It might still be something that you're dealing with right now. The beautiful energy is, I mean, I love the energy here because it's fire energy, the page of wands, which, you know, with the emperor, I mean, the emperor is a card of Aries. I mean, he's the great initiator, somebody who takes control, takes authority, takes the lead. He is not somebody who allows the world to act on them. He acts on the world, you know. He is a force of nature. He channels that power, that raw power to shape his world the way he wants it. You know, he's somebody who understands how to make it happen, be in control of situations, take control, take the initiative, take charge. Um, and with the Page of Wands, I mean, it feels like, I mean, there could be some kind of emperor that you're dealing with. I mean, generally it's a male energy, but there could be some kind of news to do with an opportunity uh, from some kind of emperor. Um, so it can be somebody who is very successful, very good in terms of money, career, business. can also be a father energy as well. Um, but it definitely feels like this Page of Wands is bringing in some good news to you. Now, the other, I mean, it might well be for some of you. I mean, looking at the cards on the table, there could be, um, it could be a large business. I mean, generally it's, it's either a very large um, national or multinational business that's offering you some kind of opportunity. Or well, the spirit is kind of saying that's, it seems to be that's, that may well be applying for some of you. Certainly in terms of business and career, there may well be some opportunity or window that ignites your passion here. And it feels like a, a very large, very large company, lots of tiers, lots of structure. So that might well apply for some of you as well, because I have to say, you know, page of wands is, is generally the beginnings of good news. It could be to do with some kind of, um, it could be a, things like job interviews, or it could be to do with a business opportunity here, or a client here, you know, some kind of contract. Um, but the definite energy of the Knight of Swords, and we have two Knight of Swords here, there is news coming in that is bringing swift change. And it feels like positive change. Because again, we have this positive change. You can see the scales on there. There's the universe saying it's your time to receive because there's this energy of you've been wanting the scales of, of fairness and right and truth to be re readdressed, rebalanced in your life. 
And that has been the challenge to come through the other side of a situation and feel good about it and step into your light once more and release whatever this justice represented for you. Something that threw you out of balance that you needed to recover from. This is where the universe is saying it's your time to receive. You can see the scales there. So the universe is definitely an energy. You're definitely being watched over in this energy. And again, this can be somebody reaching out, offering you something. It feels like there could be some news to do with some kind of opportunity, a window, a door opening for you. And it's followed up by some news, good news. Um, certainly with this Knight of Swords, it feels it could be to do with an offer, an actual offer. So it feels like this might be, this. there could be stages to this, but ultimately it feels like it's leading to some kind of offer or opportunity. Absolute good news on the cards. It feels very beautiful here because it's linked to the pentacles energy, which can, I mean, it can be to do with money and career here, I feel. Um, with the cards on the table, it feels to do with money and career. And again, that sun energy is the, the wanting of abundance, the wanting of that success, the wanting of to get the balance back in your life. And you might have been working towards this. And this is the universe saying the hard work is going to be rewarded. So I love this energy because it is linking to that new beginning. So it definitely feels like some new offer opportunity. Or news, news coming in that's bringing change. So final message. We have Flamingo, Unity Heart. You are being called on to work on collective healing. It, it feels in this energy there is some restoration, some healing that's been needed here because you've been recovering from something, Leo. But it definitely feels that you're going to come through the other side of it. There is some progress. I mean, the Knight of Swords is a card of seeing progress, hearing some good news as a result of swift progress in a situation and something coming in quite fast. So it feels to do with someone reaching out, your time to receive, it's that kind of energy. So I love, I love the reading here. Your ignite, your, and it definitely feels like your ignition for, ignite your passion for life is very much linked to this new beginning. The pages are the beginnings of something new, the beginnings of change. And again, the, the nights are all about bringing swift change in. And it feels in this situation, it's in the form of some news coming your way, some progress in a situation. Lovely energy, Leo. So I hope you enjoyed the reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I hope it's a wonderful month for you all and I will see you next time. Thank you.